Greetings from the ThemeRex team. Today I'll show you how you can make content visibility control in Gutenberg and full site editing themes using the Conditional Blocks plugin. I have an all right WordPress theme installed on my server. It has lots of different blocks and sections. And let's say I want to show my articles only to log in site members and ask new members to sign up to be able to see it. I'm currently logged in as an admin. So let's go to our WordPress dashboard. Navigate Plugins, Add New. In the search field, type in Conditional Blocks. Then click Install Now. And then activate it. The plugin builds in into your Gutenberg, so let's go to our main page and click Edit on our top bar. Let's scroll down to our Articles section. Click on it and in our page structure let's choose the entire row. So we will work with the entire section. On the right side panel click on the Visibility Conditions and then Configure Conditions. Here we have three sections – Content Block, Preset Manager and Settings. In the Preset Manager you can create conditional presets. This feature is available only in the Pro version. In Settings you can set breakpoints for your responsive conditions for desktop, tablet and mobile. And also you can enable a Developer's Mode. But let's go back to the main tab. Here we can create one or more visibility conditions and check documentation. Unfortunately, in the free version we can change visibility depending on screen sizes and whether the user is logged in or logged out. In the pro version, here we have much more options. But even the free version allows us creation of a simple membership site. Let's make this block visible only for logged in users. When we apply this condition, we will see the conditional label on the top of the section. Let's save the changes and check our websites. Since we are logged in, right now we can see this section. But if we copy the URL and open it in the incognito mode and scroll down to our article section, we will not see it. Let's create the text block for our not logged in users asking to log in. I'll go back to our page and close the structure for now. Let's add a new section and add a paragraph widget here. And let's type in a message that says that the below content is for members only. And let's offer to log in if the user already has an account. I will add the link to the login page. And the other option is if the user does not have an account yet and let's offer him to create one. I have a membership pricing page so I'll add the link there. And I will duplicate a spacer block and move it below the message so it has some spaces above the footer. And now let's click on the section in the structure, choose the entire row, go to visibility conditions and let's set it to be displayed only for logged out users. Now let's save the changes and update our page. Ok, when we are logged in, we still can see our Articles section. But if we update the page in the incognito mode as not logged in user, we will see our text block now. We can click Login and enter our login and password. Or we can click Sign up and create a new account by choosing one of the membership plans. Hope this video was helpful. Please subscribe for more useful tutorials.